what's poppin' it's bay? Hope you're having a wonderful day and welcome back to Fin Forever Skies with this fine day we'll be upgrading the ship. I've been kinda of grinding off camera quite a bit here. Got also some large water bottles, um, which is actually very nice. They hold a lot more water than the small ones. Um and also again, if you guys can see I've been grinding for synthetics and metal scraps. I've been grinding for a lot. Also got a couple of ship upgrades just to make my life a little easier so you know I can actually record longer focusing on the storyline of the game rather than focusing on starving and, and not dying. Um but um finally let's grab all uh build tool where wherever I put it. Um airship builder. Because this episode we're gonna be focusing on upgrading the ship. Making it larger and bigger and more beautiful. Um, first we need to remove the fuel out of here, out of our engines. We're gonna pick these Maximum up. Maximum flight speed reduced. Yep, I know, I know. Maximum flight altitude I know. reduced. I know. Remove all that. And Maximum flight speed reduced. Pretty much do nothing now. Um, let's see. Remove gun. That way there's attachments. Hold up. So we gotta start removing these parts here. This is gonna give us even more synthetic scraps and shit. Um, and I ran out of space. Shit. Um, so yoink yoink. And can't yoink anything else. Um, yeah, we really do need to fix our storage issue, because we do have a massive storage issue. Another thing I've been kind of needing to fix. Um, but for now, let's wait also some more rooms, because these are gonna be big time important. They do weigh a lot, so I need to see how much more space can my ship even hold. Oh, um, okay, looks like we do a good amount of upgrades, it looks like. Calories level is decreasing. Calories level is decreasing. Ship load is getting pretty big. There you go, but that gives us a lot more space to work with. Um, I do actually want to add some stuff like doorways and stuff. And oh, this is how you upgrade the balloons. Oh, balloon core or expansion? Um, which you know what? Hold up, reduce. No, 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 no. I don't want to reduce. No, that wouldn't be good. Cause I've also, while I've been grinding, I've been also finding a lot of helium. And now look at the helium count. Um, or what's required for um building the ship upgrades? It's not that much. So, balloon core, the boot, the base of the balloon, each airship has at least one, but it can possibly add more. Um, um, so, oh, that adds an entirely new balloon. Oh, fuck. How do I add another one? Huh. But, hold up. Let's grab some mechanical parts because we can also, um,. So before we actually add another, another balloon core, let's get ourselves um expanded balloon. Um, cause that will expand the balloon. Do we have to actually walk up? Uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so we let's go back this way. Or yeah, let's go back that way. Okay, there we go. And then, um, oh, we actually do. Um, hmm. Which I would like to go to the the, the two balloon option, but let's just go for a very, you know what? Let's go for a very long boy instead. Um, we won't be able to go for a secondary balloon yet, but we'll be able to do it in the future. So let's get also some more mechanical parts. Um, that's bothering me. I'm gonna fix that. Um, machine parts. Okay. Then we go for a very, very long boy. Is it gonna actually grab? There you go. We're gonna go for a very long boy. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. We're very long. Oh, shit. How far does that go back now? Oh, my lordy, Jesus. Holy shit. Alright. So, how much more can we actually add in terms of room space? Um, an absolute crap load. You know what? Why not? Let's go back a couple more. There we go, there we go, and there we go. Um, we can go back like one more, I think. I think I will be happy with that. Yeah, I'm completely happy with this. All right, there we go. How do we add a doorway? That's my question. Door. All right, I want to add a door back here. There we go. Um, glass. Sadly, we don't really have much. Fuck. Doorway, there we go. 
um, plastic. We don't have many options for windows and shit. So let's just add these plastic panels. I don't want to walk outside my ship and die like I did uh, a couple episodes ago. What was that off camera? I can't exactly remember. Oh, I'll build, I'll build guns out of power. Um, so this is something I can show you. Finally, I figured out actually how to uh, recharge stuff. You just need the tool charger. Um, that's all you need. Holy shit, our ship is so long and beautiful. Holy shit. And we can open this door. Oh my god. Our ship is so large. Oh my god. That is awesome. Oh my god. I love it. Look how long it is. That's what she said. <laughs> oh god, how am I going to park the ship? God, this thing's going to be so difficult to park. Oh my god. I hope I can figure a way to fix that issue. Oh, Jesus. I don't think I'm going to be able to get it to fit that often. That's what she said again. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, fuck. Alright, come on. Walk. I didn't want to do that. I want, I want to add some plastic walls so I don't fall outside the ship. Okay, there I go. There's one, there's two, there's three, there's four, five. Are we going to actually have enough stuff? Hi, gnome wives. Yeah, I married two gnomes. The more gnomes I find, the more wives I'll have. That sounds so fucked. At least it's a video game. That, <laughs> that sounds so fucked. The more gnomes I find, the more wives I'll have. I don't know why. That sounds so bad to me. Oh. Okay. Let's add a catwalk back here. Oh. And back here, I actually, I, I kind of have a plan of adding a good amount of catwalks. And we're about to be out of resources. So you know what that means. It's time to go back on the pipe thing and grind again. So, let me show you how this game works a little bit, if you guys don't, uh, if this is the first time watching. So, it's kind of like Wrath, um, where you kind of grab, you go into this thing, um, to gather a bunch of these resources that float towards you. Again, kind of like Wrath. Um, and again, this game's also, I would say, very much like Subnautica, which actually the, the, the publisher that helped publish Subnautica is also going to be the publisher of this game, too. So, you know, it's kind of, a uh, you know, this game really does make me think of Subnautica. But also mix a raft with this, this this thing here, um, which we let's gather a little bit more plastic, not plastic synthetics, more uh, synthetics. I can't really say that word very well, but um, all right, there you go. We got a hundred more that should give us enough to keep building. I hope we can get lights. My ship is starting to get very dark. Um, so come on, let's go. Add a platform veil, platform veil, platform veil. Really only want me out for now I'm only gonna go out twice, so I'm going just about heal. Um but I, I, I will tell you now we will go further out. Um so let's think here. Let's add a veil and let's put this heal. This um I can't put that actually anywhere. Else. Let's grab the engines, actually. Just thought about that. Let's grab the engines and the important things. Um let's not grab those. We just need the engines, so let's move this, move that. How do you actually build engines? I just thought about this. More engines. I would like to have more engines. That's one upgrade I really would like. Metal, uh, machine parts. Okay, so machine parts. Where's the metal parts that I put down? Didn't I put metal parts down? Let's grab the more machine parts. Gonna need those real bad. There's the there's the metal. This should give us enough to build like I think two engines. Yeah. That'll give us enough power to give us uh, two more engines, which would be very nice to have. Um, who says no to more engine power? Yes, let's ruin the planet even more with pollution from our engines. Totally not like the planet has already been destroyed by an ecological disaster. That's, now let's just re-pollute the planet again. Man, building engines take a while. Oh shit, I just realized this. We could pick up a bunch of posters and paintings and move- Actually, let's not move them around. I kind of want to just um, keep them kind of all in one area. Printing, so, completed. printing has been completed. Let's build one more engine. Um, I think that'll be real flipping good. Um, so let's, it, especially now that we're much bigger, we'll probably gonna be much slower. 45. I think that's a, I think originally we were only like 29. So now that we're actually up to 45. Oh shit. Very supersonic speed here. Um, let's also grab. 
Let's grab all that fuel. Dehydration. Okay, I see. Oh yeah, by the way, Freezo. We have a Freezo. I forget. I don't know if I mentioned this already, but I have a Freezo now. Um, that pretty much is so how it works is you just put your food in it, it completely stops the time of rot. So that my food never rots pretty much. Um, based off the freezer. So yeah. Um so let's come on. Craft the come on. Printing completed. There we go. We have a fourth engine. Um so we're gonna put this the uh, heel. Sixty kilometers. Okay, so we we can now go up to sixty kilometers. Um, yeah, let's craft a little bit more fuel. Oh, I'm almost out of that, Steve. Um, I don't think we have much pla. Oh, we can only make one thing. Okay, I need to grab more plastic. Not plastic, synthetic. Okay, yeah, fuel does not take long to cra craft. So let's grab let's grab that metal anyhow. And I think we got some synthetics coming out of the planet there. Yep, but not much. Where is all the? All right, there we go. Grab some more. Um, that means we can craft some more. And we have 104 synthetic fuel. Printing completed. Um, it's the lowest quality, so let's add a lot there. And let's try how fast we can go. Um, I know we can go 60, so um, let's go. Let's go. Let's see how fast we can go. Okay, going. Holy shit! This is much faster than. Oh shit! Okay, but we're going against the wind, so right now we're only going 43. But I used to only go like 15 when I was up against the wind. So let's like explore this little like two light beacon location. Hopefully that's not crash the ship. Uh, is that fuel? Oh, that's hydrogen down there too. Ooh. So yeah, pretty much another part of this game, if you're watching this for the first time, is um, well this is how you pretty much explore. Since we can't go down to the bottom of the planet because as it's covered in dust very dangerously infectious dust that would immediately kill me um it pretty much is the reason why half the planet's wiped out right now um so yeah we can't really go down on the surface of the planet i mean you actually can it's just you have to get below the dust level which you can only do in certain places in this game um so let's grab these mechanical parts because i need them desperately now since i pretty much ran out of them completely with the ship upgrades that we've done so uh, just check if the camp, if anything's lagging on my end, but nope, nothing's lagging. Um, let's see, nothing in there. Um, ooh, computer parts, I'll take that. I'm so good bored. But, what I'm very much interested in is this hydrogen. Because I can upgrade the ship with that. And I also can get a second gear, um, um, uh, blue. Um, uh, new blueprints. Okay, got some new blueprints. Got another circuit board right there. Anything in here? Oh, big data pad. What is that gonna give me? Meteorite wall. Or oh, paint, paint, paint. Okay. Not wall. Um, okay. Also, I did find a paint gun while I was, um, you know, doing my off screen stuff. So, yeah. Um, you guys can probably guess what a paint gun does. So it's not, it's not too hard to think. But, um, do, 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 do. You know? Yoink. You know what? Let's grab a little, little extraction thing. Let's grab this coffee here. Okay, grabby, grabby, grabby. Oh wait, hey lads, look, there's more. There's more uh, uh, helium. Yoink, yoink. There you go. How much? Did that give us enough helium for um, balloon core? No, we need six for that. So it looks like it's going to be a while before we can get that little blimp thing. Extra blimp power. Um, let's go on over here. Grab this solid state battery. Um, oh, come on. There you go. There you go. Now we can go up. Let's see how fast we can go when we're going against the wind. Because I am curious. Alright. So... I 
Actually, it's more like 49 is what max limit it looks like. Well, pool. Mm, let's see. Where is it that we want to go? There's a bunch of stuff over this way. What is that? So that's like infectious vines sticking out of the planet. Is it a purple light? What does a purple light mean? What the hell? Let's go check this shit out. Um, what the hell? Is that a secondary purple light? What? Okay, this is new. Unless I'm forgetting, this might actually be a certain location that sends you underground. It might be. Um... There's only one way to find out. Oh, slow down. Slow down, bae. Unknown location reached. Slow down, bae. Both, some of my, uh, all my engines have run out of fuel. Oh, uh, one of them. Only one of them. Which one was that, though? My guess is probably the helium one. Because we had a lot less, um, helium. Oh, shit. It's this engine. Maybe that's why I wasn't going as fast as I thought. Um. Yeah, let's shove a little bit of fuel in there. God, we're gonna be running through fuel like it's nothing. Uncharted area. The preliminary analysis started. Yeah. Analysis completed. No unidentified objects were detected. Well, over here there's a lot of plants, but I'm not seeing anything um that tells me this goes on the ground. Maybe it's on the it's likely on the other side. It's likely. Um don't really want these. Um, actually, wait, those seeds. Lots- ooh, those are oh, these things. Those are actually good to have. I'll actually keep those, because I can make a garden now. Um, in the last episode, or between episodes, I can't remember which- when I actually unlocked it. But there was a stage where I did actually unlock something. Um, is there any ent- where's the entrance to this place? Okay, I think I see the entrance. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Damage something. But let's see if this gets us close enough to do a, like a jump heal. Uh, I don't care. I'll get rid of that. Um, let's see. Uh, store everything we can. Store everything we can. Bada bang, bada boom. Um, store everything we can. Store everything we can. Actually, let's let's drink a little bit of that. Actually. Grab that. Let's grab some more repair kits just in case. Um, yoink and yoink and yoink. We really don't need this build gun. Um, before we actually go, let's actually put this up here. Also, look at that. Look at this little clay pot. I forgot what is it called again? I think I know what it's called. Um, shit, what is it called again? Shit. Oh, Ukrainian pot. I don't know, I found this thing. I also found a lantern during our little adventures, or the Ukrainian pot. I found a bunch of collectible things. We still to this day have a little airship uh, model here. Um, so yeah. Battery's almost out of uh, juice there. Okay, 25%, 24%. Oh shit, look at that! I didn't realize with the charging station you can actually see how much um, electricity your uh, thing has without even opening the menu. Um, I guess no wives, um, you guys gotta move, um, I also gotta move this mug I found one day, but I gotta move the bed, so no wives, I'm gonna move you guys, um, um, like right here, so no wife one, you go there, um, no, no wife two, you go here, um, 
And you guys can get your mug that you guys can share. And I'll put the bed, like, right next to you guys. So they've put... Uh, I'll sleep next to you guys. Not with you guys anymore. There I go. Alright. There I go. Move to Gnome Lives. I think I'm gonna grab this thing. And just leave off a little bit of a kind of a cliffhanger here. Um, I just realized how long I've been recording for. Um, and I don't really want this video being overly long. So, I'm gonna actually end this here. If you guys like the video of me, well, you know, um, upgrading the ship. Um, please consider subscribing, liking, and comment below for more Forever Skies content. Um, and with that being said, I'll see you guys in the future in the next episode where we explore this purple building. So yeah, peace.